Hey everyone, it's your old mate Shano here. Thanks for stopping by to check out this video. Today we're going to review the documentary film called Shane by answering three questions about it. What did I like? What didn't I like? And would I recommend it? First of all though, let's learn a little bit more about this film. Shane Warne, in case you didn't know, was an Australian cricketer, well known for his ability to spin the ball and bamboozle the batsman facing him. After retiring from the sport, he went on to have a career as a commentator on a number of TV channels. He passed away unexpectedly in March 2022 at the age of 52. This Amazon documentary film takes you through his life and career right up to just before he died. So our first question then was, what did I like about this? Well, this is a thorough run-through of the history of Warren, and I liked the use of photos from right back in his school days to tell his story. It turns out he's always had that shock blonde hair. I also really enjoyed seeing some legends of the game sharing their thoughts and memories. These are guys who I watched as a kid, the heroes of my youth, so to speak. It was kind of sad to see how old they've got now, but also really cool to see their passion for the game is still going strong, and more importantly, to hear their expert takes on the impact that Warren had on the game. Another standout was that lots of the footage was from right in the time of my life when cricket was my life. I was obsessed with it as a kid, and I remember lots of the footage and games that are shown in the film. It was quite the nostalgia trip. So what didn't I like about this film? I thought they glossed over his two big scandals quite quickly, those being the bookie scandal and Warren's drug suspension. They certainly didn't shy away from it, but it only seemed to be covered over the space of a couple of minutes. And while I didn't necessarily want them to dwell on it, I did want some more details. So would I recommend this? Well, if you're a sports fan, especially a cricket fan, then I think you will really enjoy this. It follows a fairly standard sports documentary format, but there's some interesting info and great archival footage in this. Tie into that the roller coaster of career highs and lows, and the completely unexpected end to his life, and this is a film that is well worth checking out.